Tomorrow, I turn 29. I'm celebrating the last birthday of my 20s and one more year before I enter my 30s. When Dom asked me what I want to do for my birthday this year, I really only had one answer. Are you ready? Yeah? You ready to go? To go on a mini road trip with my cats. Okay, let's go. Stormy over there, Panther over here. Let's go to it's funny how as I'm getting older, all I want to do is spend quality time with the people that I love, and that includes my cats. I've never been on a trip with my cats before, even though it's always been a dream of mine. So I thought what better time to do it than my 29th birthday. We just got here. This place is so pretty. Home for the next few days. Since it was our first time going on a trip with our cats and we're here for a few days, I didn't want to leave them at home alone. Plus, you guys know I love cooking, so we bought a bunch of groceries and cooking supplies with us. We even bought our own vacuum, security systems, and wipes just to make sure the cats were safe the whole time. I was craving Korean barbecue, so we gotta make some samjang. Samjang, also known as Korean barbecue dipping sauce, is mildly spicy and super savory. It adds tons of flavor to the meat and it pairs really well with pork belly. One of my favorite parts about Korean barbecue is the side dishes. They're so refreshing, adds great texture to the dish, so let's make a few of my favorites. Mmm! This hits the spot every time. Since we're here for a couple days, I decided to make a bunch of side dishes. That way we can actually have them for breakfast, for lunch, or whenever, because I need the veggies. This is one of my favorite side dishes. It's so good. I feel like when the meat is really high quality, you just need salt and pepper. Do you like pork belly better or do you like beef better? Beef. Like beef? Mm -hmm. I like pork belly to the down. Pork's so good though. I love pork belly. Mm. Did you try the sauce? Is this a veggie wrap or a meat wrap? It looks like a burrito. Mm. Mm. Good. What's that? Heartburn? No, I'm choking. <laughs> but what's that? I think the best type of nights is when you have good food and good company. 
We both had extreme food coma from one of the best meals of our lives, and the cats were also exhausted. <laughs> we finished the night drinking wine, sitting by the fire, and playing a few intense rounds of Jenga. It's funny because I can't help but think back to when I turned 19. All I wanted to do was celebrate my first legal drink and dance the night away. But I think they say you know you found your life partner when you can make anything enjoyable. The second thing that I asked for my birthday is to sleep in. Does this mean that I'm getting old? There's something special about waking up to the sound of rain. One of my life dreams is to move into a house like this in the mountains and wake up to this view every morning. After getting ready, the sun also came out, so we decided to go on a little adventure. Whistler is a special place to us. It's where we had our first trip as a couple, where Dom proposed to me, and also where we got married. And now, it will also be the first place where we bought our cats on a road trip. I adopted my cats five years ago. Even though they don't look alike, they're actually brothers from the same litter. Me and Dom always joke around and say they're us in another life. Storm is an adventurous one, and Panther is a stay-at-home cat. Never in a million years would I think that going on a mini trip with my husband and my cats would be my dream birthday celebration. If I'm being honest, I didn't think I'd get married before 30, but I'm so lucky for my little family that I have. Yeah, I'll have a white hot chocolate with no whip. No, that, do you guys no. have any puppuccino? Uh, yes, we do. How many would you like? Can I get one, please? All right. Hello. Hi. The pop to start. Thank, Thank you. you. Got it. This is their first time trying a puppuccino. Does he like it? Mm -hmm. oh. It's on his nose. I'm gonna die. Hey, Storm. It's so cute. Hey, Storm. Okay, that's too much. You like it? <laughs> Worth the road trip? Dom wanted to surprise me with a steak dinner. It's pretty cute because he's been prepping and practicing all week to surprise me while I was away in Mexico. Can you tell that acts of service is our love language? cook and dom cleans but this was honestly really fun it's really gonna be such a good meal cooking together and taste testing together dom said one of his goals this year is to learn how to cook more this way he can also treat me to a yummy home cooked meal maybe we'll incorporate these into our weekly date nights Thanks for dinner. Happy birthday. Thank you. You're eating steak with chopsticks. Mmm. Mmm. Oh my god. Are you gonna do a dummy cooks page? Mmm. <laughs> mmm. Really good. 
This is probably the best cut of meat I've ever worked with. Yeah? Yeah. Cheers, babe. Cheers. Happy birthday. Thank you. This was the perfect was birthday so dinner. Probably one of the best meals I've ever had. Mmm. Yeah. Mmm. I think once you pass 25, time just starts flying. Maybe it's because in my 20s, I was so busy trying to figure out my life, I never even got time to stop and realize with a blink of an eye, 10 years has flew by. Don't get me wrong, I loved my 20s. I graduated from school, got my first big girl job, bought my first home, traveled, met the love of my life, and started my dream job as a food blogger. And I built the best community I can ever ask for. But for the last year of my 20s, I wanted to document my life before I turned 30, and that includes every little thing that I want to do, whether big or small. Welcome to my new series, Before 30.